Warning, this video contains many funny jokes with educational materials and is not suitable to watch by vegetarians and stubborn Karens whose lives are sad. Where's your manager? If you feel offended by this small joke above, please f*** off because I'm the manager of this video. I don't feel sad. By the way, if you're watching on YouTube, you can turn on sub in English, Vietnamese or Tagalog over here. Man, a word used to describe a human being that has a third leg at the very mm. center of their body. Or is it just that? The word man can be used as an adjective. You proud of your man, you say, Mame. You disappointed of your man's PP, you say, Man. To your non PP ally who soon cheated on you with the man you said PP was disappointed. You saw your man cheated on you in anger, you say, Meh! Aha! Other than a noun or an adjective in a sentence, men can eat the course with other words to create new words which resemble nothing like the man. What the fuck? For example, Manga, a series of Japanese comic book. Mangwa, a series of Japanese comic book, but Korean and more ara ara. Ara ara. Manhua, a series of Japanese comic book, but Korean and more ara ara, but actually kinda bing chilling. Bing chilling. Now, since I have able to draw your attention to the word man, let's start with the definitions. What is a man? In my opinion, a man is not just a human who has a shiitake mushroom and two carrots egg under his belly. A man is a man. A man can be lenient, merciful, humane, etc. As well as evil, cruel, selfish, etc. If a man were to be filled with all the goodness, he is a saint. If a man were to be filled with pure evilness, he is an animal. If a man were to be filled with both goodness and badness equally, well, he is a man. And that's my definition of a man. A human male who can maintain the balance of his goodness and badness. From this statement, you guys may ask about those who are in the middle of saint man and man evil. What do they call? Well, in my opinion, they are called boy so girl. I know, I know, you guys will be like, why are girls here too? And why are they became men? <laughs> but I will explain this matter on the next video of Complexify Season 2, Woman, okay? Because in this video, I will only complexify the main character of this video, which is men. So, ladies, let the men enjoy being first for once, okay? Because we always came first in bed anyway. So boy, why? When we are first born as humans, we are babies, newborns, infants. Then we will grow into boys or girls. This is the time when we start picking up personality traits. And because we have just started picking up personality traits, we cannot call a boy who wants to taste every puss puss a pervert. We call him a fuck boy. We cannot call a boy who treated on his exam an unfaithful man. We call him BB head. Because, because he taken around his books and other exam papers, right? I, I actually don't know lah. I, I am a Vietnamese, so I, I kinda confused, but yes. We, anyway, we cannot call a boy gay just because he's being gay. We call him literally turning gay by Timmy. Yes. Anyway, you guys got the point. This leads to our next question. What if we never maintain the balance of good and bad? Do we stay a boy forever? And the answer is... Yes. Sadly, a lot of us never grown up. People tend to complain about others and 
or even worse, satisfied with themselves. It is nice to love yourself and it is good to be grateful for what you have. Yet, a man stops yearning to learn, to achieve, to be a better man is no man. You are either a boy or an old man who awaits debts or have already done his bucket list. So, how do you become a great man? Well, it's hard to say because I only make this video for fun and to share with you guys what I have learned from books combined with my real life experience. And speaking of life experience, I'm only in my 20s, which is one fourth of my life. So in another 10 years, I might come up with another way to become a better version of myself. Yet, it could be a great opportunity for me to reflect on myself 10 years after. So, here goes nothing. A great man is a man who is capable of maintaining his scale of good and evil. Yet, he does not necessarily always maintain them. It is necessary to take breaks, have some fun, and touch some grasses, as well as put in extra work to get what the man wants. However, the man should acknowledge how much fun he had and how many hours he put into his work because in euphoria, we became rotten. In stressfulness, we sicken ourselves. A great man knows when to stop and have the ability to do so. With the consistency of the man, it is soon that he will achieve a certain amount of power, both mentally and physically. He must learn to use it to mercilessly cripple the one who harms him and his family. In return, he must reward those who contribute to his success. That is a way a great man maintains his balance. Those are a few sentences which are resemble from what I have learned while staying and working in Canada. Hopefully this will help me to become a better version of myself as well as making a better version of my subscribers. Megas! Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, please consider subscribing and liking this video. It will encourage me to make more videos for you guys. Shout out to my Discord subjects Han and Oshi for translating this video into Vietnamese and Tagalog and Dread for editing this video. By the way, sorry I will not be streaming anymore due to my job in real life, but I am still going to make videos on YouTube, so don't worry. With that saying, See you all in the next video. Oyasumi no no cha. Okay. This leads to our next questions. What if I. This. What the fuck? As well as making a better version of my subscribers. Bleh, 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 no. Meh, bleh, no. <sighs> As well as making a better version of my subscribers. No, what the fuck happened to my subscribers? Subscribers, me, 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 me. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this videos. If you do, please consider subscribe. <laughs> Fucking mails. Fuck, I have so much mail. Fuck. <laughs> I hate my real life dog. <laughs> I've been receiving so much mail today. Fuck me. Come on, let me record ready.